Welcome to another episode of the Coral Island series and let's head out because yeah it's morning. We need to harvest, oops, we need to harvest our first crop and gather wood. I forgot there was like a lot of quests we were working towards. It's actually been quite some time since I played the game which is quite unfortunate because I've been very excited about it. There's so much garbage on this um, plot of land. At least we can grab quite a bit and not many swings. Ooh, I need somewhere to uh, inventory. So this is the shipping box, yes. Uh, is there storage in the house? I imagine we'll get to be crafting at some point. Uh, okay, so we need more wood for the chest. I wonder where we make it. Maybe just in this menu? We may not need like a crafting table. All right, I think I have enough wood to craft this chest. Okay. We also have a backpack. It looks like I still have space in my backpack, but maybe I don't. I guess these are like what I can open up to eventually. Okay, uh, let's toss that, put the trash here, craft this guy, okay, can we place it, oh we can, okay, did I place it up on here, probably not, yeah, they probably, the house probably eventually takes up this space, uh, let's just stick it up front I guess, Direct. Oh, the box has more uh, space than us. Okay. Yeah, I left a couple things on the ground. I don't know if they despawn. Let's grab that. And then we can go off to town and talk to people. And there's so much to look at. Maybe let's head up this time and see what we can find there. I think there's 30 people to meet, and I think it said we'd seen 17 of them. Got the ranch here. This is cute. Hello. Jack. Just call me Jack. Okay. I run the local ranch. Your lot has plenty of space for raising livestock. Once you're settled, maybe we can discuss raising animals. That would be good. I like the little step stool to get the stuff up on top. Man, again, the details are just incredible in this game. Inspect. A picture of young Jack. Oh. Looks like it's been empty for a while. Huh. What do we uh, keep in the fridge? Still working, but it's empty inside. Huh. Don't, ju don't mind me just judging how you live. Ooh, is this the thing we need to... I can't remember what tool we needed. That one. Ooh, some wild seeds. We've got a cavern this way. Oh yes, we need like a net or something for that. Oh, quite the garden you've got going here. It's like an armory or something. I love the style of the house. Ooh. Shouldn't go in. I don't know whose room it is. Ah, okay. This is a really cool room. There's quite a few people who live here. So we've got another room set up here. Jack's- oh, this is Jack's house? Didn't we just talk to Jack and he's in a house? Or like in a building with a house? <laughs> and he's got like a cellar going on. That looks not good. Whatever's happening right there. So we've got like old rails. Lots of wood out this way. Okay, this water's pretty. Oh, yeah. Oh, I can cut. Oh, I can go out into it. Cool. Oh, those are pretty. That looks like a chest. What is this? Oh, harvest. Oh, wasabi. I actually don't know what wasabi's plant looks like. You don't understand what this says. Huh. Danger. Inspect. 
You hear a clanking of swords from inside. You wonder if there is some fight going on. That's usually what swords clashing means. What's in here? We don't know. In fact, there's something odd about this cabin. The fact that it's abandoned, tiny, hiding in a corner. Check our map. We are here. It looks like there's stuff off onto the sides and stuff as well. Ooh, jeez. So we've walked through here, all the way along this. We've, ah, uh, Jack, Kira, and Kenny. Okay. I wonder what this temple is. I almost missed this, uh, this right here. I think that's compost. I don't want to go too close to that. It just seems like a bad idea. Oosh, there's a monkey. Hey, buddy. It's just a cool temple. There's nothing much to ooh, inspect. It won't budge. It's for a later time, I think. Ooh, a morel. And wasabi. That's a pretty bug. Hot springs in the farm. Let's head off to the hot springs then. No, this one. Thank you. What is this? Ooh, canola. Another blocked path. Let's grab that morel. Oh, this is beautiful. I'd be here all the time. <laughs> so we've got a van. I think someone's living in, by the looks of it. Got a little garden situation happening. Can we... Oh, it's a shop. Sorry, we're closed today. Okay. Does it say on the map what this is? Ben's caravan. Okay. Let's see what this is. Oh, the bathhouse. Temporarily out of service. Well, that's just rude. Oh, this place is beautiful. And these must be little places you can stay. Oh, hi. Uh, Takeba? Is that you, Taro? No. Oh. <laughs> ah, so this is his room. Okay. What are you? The observatory. Ooh. This is really cool. Ah, oh, I love that. This place is huge. I uh, don't know whose room this is. Okay. Ooh. Got like film, maybe? Quite the setup here. It's a lot of screens for one chair. <laughs> and then, yep, somebody else's room. So this must be two people who live here. Why oh, that's purple. Okay. So the hot springs entrance ahead on the left. So that's where we just saw, but this must be where it's normally uh, running water, but it doesn't look like it. I think there's a panda eating bamboo over there. Can we get to that spot? We might be able to. Let's go see if we can go see that panda. It is blocked. But it looks so cool. I want to go over there. Ooh, this is pretty. Like all the things hanging in the trees. So the bamboo forest and the observatory. Thank you for the compost. So we've got like climbing. So this is still blocked. I'm trying to kind of uh, explore the outskirts a little bit. So we've got an artist over here. They've also got quite the garden going. Closed. Okay. Oh, we just missed it about an hour ago. Okay. So we've gone up and in this area. God, there's so much to have explored. <laughs> I 
think I've spent two days exploring and I've gotten so little of it looked at. <laughs> like, I don't think... Maybe I've been to the lookout down here, but I don't think so. So look, there's the lookout. There's all the beach stuff I haven't seen. I think we checked out some of this, but not all of it. All right, I guess we need to start heading home. Ooh, I got a starfish from a garbage can. Would you believe it? I found some trash in the garbage can. There's no exit here. It looks like something's being built here. Hello? Derek, what did you say? Uh, hi! <laughs> uh, the woodland, the lake, the beach. Is this a bit of a cemetery, it looks like? Is it supposed to look like that? It looks incomplete. I wonder what does. I think it looks fine. Maybe it just means the book? I think I'm working my way to my house, but I'm not entirely sure. <laughs> The ranch. Oh, that must mean we're down then. Not through there. This way. Maybe I will plant these wild seeds. There we go. See what we grow. Uh, all right. That out. Ooh, I've got a note. Brief mail. Hello, Nox. Looking for a way to pass time. Or maybe you want to earn some extra coin while waiting for your crops to grow. Say no more. Come pay Eleanor and I a visit at the beach shack. We have the perfect welcoming guest for you. Okay. Uh, new item alert. Introducing basic bag. It has a total of 20 compartments. That is a whole extra five extra compartments with then the extra, the basic tool belts. Carry more, do more, worry less. Available now at Sam's General Store for 500 a coin. Okay. Uh, I might head... Uh, here. Uh, truck. Uh, because I thought, I was thinking about going to the, the beach would be a good idea today. Everything's watered over there. I don't know what I'm growing over there, though. <laughs> could I have gone down this way? I could, if I could make a, uh, a path, but, well, it wouldn't hurt to harvest some stuff, I guess. I made a path. <laughs> Alright, so let's see what's down here. And then the beach shack is over there. Okay. Ooh. We have another one of those potentially sick trees. I don't understand what it says. That's quite the view. Oh no. That's bad. I got a whole fish from that garbage can. What do we see here? Looks a little rusty. Perhaps it's the ocean air. Probably. Oh man, you can see little bits of... I think it's oil? Hello. Utaru? Eh, what are you look? Are you looking for farm advice? Never worked the land myself. I'm more at home at sea. Except for my plants here. My lovelies. They're beautiful. Got the lighthouse. It's closed until nine. I guess I can wait a little bit. This is very pretty. Sir, there seems to be a problem outside the lighthouse. Ooh. Very nice. Uh, we must have to enter through a different situation. Uh, no, there's a door. I just can't go in. It's fine. I don't. I don't need to be um up in a lighthouse without knowing what I'm doing. Ooh, there's so much stuff down here. Okay. Oh, that swing. You can't go very far. There's a wall right there, but it would be nice to sit on nonetheless. Got some glass. Yeah, that makes sense. Ooh. Let's clean up the garbage. Do I need to sickle that? I do. I'm a little worried. Okay, we do still have two inventory spaces. Let's put this stuff down here for now and go talk to that person. They said they were going to give um, like a fishing pole in the net. So I kind of want to get those before we fill our inventory. The Coral Inn. We're not quite where we need to be yet. Hello. Nope. Hello. This is Judge Ross. She doesn't want to talk to me. Alright then. Ooh. 
pretty. Perfect. This looks cozy. I don't know why you'd need a fire on a drop of island, but... Extraterrestrial life beyond Earth. How to expand love. It seems like almost every house here has this coral decora decoration thingy. Hey, kiddo. So there's quite a few people living in this uh, half. Yeah, we've got a sewing location. Do the twins ever use the sewing machine? Hello. Alice, I think it might be a good idea to rent out sales space in the lobby. Hmm. And Suki. Oh, hey, it's nice to see you. That's the first time we met Suki. It'd be nice to have more farmers here. Being able to get local produce would be a game changer. That's what I'm here for. I meant like for Luke, for instance. He might rent some space over there by the door and sell electronics. Or, oh, the vineyard. They could sell wine here. Alice seems to be working. Okay. She's done talking. All right. It's hard to tell when their conversation has more t to it. Uh, that person's in their room, so I probably can't enter. Uh, you're not close enough to me, see? Okay. These are quite the rooms you could get. This one's full of stuff. Can't go in, you don't know whose room- oh, that's a room? That's some uh, Raj's, Ava. So there's quite a few people living here at the moment. And clearly they've been here a while. They're decorated very different than the rest of the rooms. I love all these shells and I want to pick them up, but I just don't have the inventory space. To the beach shack. What? Sunny, we can't do that to the new farmer. Poor thing, we'll get overwhelmed if we give them both things at once. Okay, then we'll start with fishing. Who doesn't like fishing? Maybe it wouldn't be such a bad idea to... Hey guys. Welcome, a new face at last. Nox, isn't it? Jim, Nox is here! Nice to see you. Jim, hmm. Hello. Eleanor, nice to meet you, Nox. Come, have a seat. We were just discussing your welcome gifts. That's not seating, but sure. Uh, it's fine if you prefer to stand. Gotta keep those like muscles strong, huh? Don't want to animate it. Speaking of leg muscles, I have the perfect workout for you. Catching bugs. Sit, sit, Nox. Uh, <laughs> there we go. So, how's farm life so far? Nothing can't handle. It's a bit tiresome sometimes, yeah? Don't forget to take breaks. Even fishing can be tiring if you do it nonstop. Settle the debate for us, Nox. Which is the better activity? Fishing or fun and ever-exciting bug catching? <laughs> My wife, the competitive ladybug. Sorry. Uh, I hate to break it to you, but I <laughs> prefer tilling. I am a farmer and all, and I don't want to have to pick. Really? That explains why you moved to the farm. Yeah. Well, in any case, here's our welcome gift to you. A fishing rod and a bug net. Thank you. You can sell your catch or donate it to the museum. Looks like they're going to need it. Good luck. Thanks, you too. And hello, Eva. Be careful out there. The path might be slippery because of the rain. The beach is still a little cold. Have you ever found anything pretty diving here? You have? Not dived. Dove? Dived? Theo showed me a handful of jade a long time ago. He told me he got it from the old treasure chest. Hmm. What do we have here? Yeah, there's something. There. Did Sonny make this himself? Hello, you two. Are you the guy I was just talking to? Posters of old bands. So I'll leave them to their game. Hey, you. 
the rain brings out different kinds of fish. You can catch some giant mud skippers easier in this weather as well. If you want to talk, Sunny seems to be in the mood to chat. Me? No, I'm not. Yeah, I gathered. Uh, need some stuff. We've got improved things, a drink, and some fish. Okay. So though she's in her room. Ooh. Family pictures. These are some massive fish. How many hats does Oliver have? Where are the fish? On the wall. Need bread, eggs, milk, and cake. The cake is very important, it would seem. A container full of rice. Ooh, nice. That's somebody else. Oh, there's a kid. I know whose room it is. That kid's. I want to be able to go faster so badly, but the button to normally sprint makes you walk slower. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna head home. Oh, the fire can't run. It's too rainy. Yeah, I think our first priority should probably be a backpack because dang, does it fill up fast. Especially if you want to have like your tools uh, on you. There's just not much space. Alright, so I think that will probably be where I end this episode. Um, just because it's already been almost 40 minutes. <laughs> this game, it's so easy for time to pass. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this episode. Uh, again, we've barely scratched the surface on exploring and there's still a lot of people we need to meet. And uh, in case you didn't see the announcement video, this is a series that will go on as long as people are interested in it. So if you are enjoying it, let me know either in a comment or leaving a like, that kind of stuff. So I hope you guys have enjoyed it. And until next time, I hope you have a wonderful day.